So, EA just dropped the Future Stars Reunion player pick. We're going to open a bunch of them and hopefully get something good. And also to see what this is. The cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins. Check out u7buy.com. There is a link in the description. And use the code HABER to get yourself a discount on all of your orders. So, I'm not quite sure what this is. It says you can get one player, one of four items. Something about special cards from previous Future Stars items, which is very interesting. Uh, it's repeatable once every 12 hours or something like that too, which is really, really cool. All right, here we go with our first Future Stars reunion player pick. What's it going to be? That is the question. Huh? Okay. Um, well, we've got a choice of Anthony, Rayner, Tierney, and Cliver. Oh, okay. So it, any card that's had a previous Future Stars item and has a, play, a special player item in FIFA 22, you can get in this player pick. Okay, that's interesting. So I guess... I think Vinny's had a Future Stars item, so you could probably get, a, you know, a special version of Vinny. That's pretty interesting. Um, hey, I mean, I'm going to take Anthony, I think. We'll just take Anthony. I don't know what he's worth. Uh, maybe about 100k. That's not too bad. Let's go and open up some more and also some mid or prime icons too. EA also dropped the mid or prime icon upgrade, so I'm going to open up one of these real quick as well. I think that's also repeatable. Where you can like do one one every 24 hours or something. Um, so we'll open up this as well. Uh, I did get mid R9 in one of these on my RTG account. This is the pay to win account though. What are we saying on the pay to win? Can we get a good icon EA? All the flares are up. No, we can't. It's pet a check. Oh. I mean, it's prime pet. No, I'm not even. I'm not even going to. No, I don't care. Or oh, whatever. That, he, he's fodder. He's fodder. He's going into another SPC. I don't care. All right. So next, uh, Future Stars. Um, player picks, whatever. I forget what they're called now. Future Stars Reunion player picks. Um, so we've established now, like, you can get sort of... On, you can't get Team of the Years, but you can get Honorable Mentions in them, which is pretty cool. So I guess Harlan would be sick. You can get, like, Headliners Vinicius Jr. Uh, there's a few really nice players you can get in this. So here we go. Next one. That's bad. That's that's not very good at all, is it? you got Inform Martinelli, Inform Bastoni... Uh, Winter Wildcard Tierney, I imagine it's probably going to pop up quite a lot in these, and numbers up Dembele. Yikes. Well, if you're an Arsenal fan, that's fantastic. If you're not, that's an L. Next, Future Stars Reunion Player Pick. Come on, let's get a big card in this, please. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Interesting, you've got Road to the Final Rodrigo, or Road to the Knockout Rodrigo. I've, I think Bakayo Saka was in there. Um, there was other players in there as well. That was all right. That's not... That's okay. That's pretty decent. I forgot who's in there. Who was that? Hey, we got a shick. Nice. All right. Next, Future Stars Reunion player pick. Come on, EA. Let's get a big pull. Let's get a uh, honorable mentions Harland or a, or a headline of Vinicius. Come on. What are we saying? Ooh. Rule breakers Trent Alexander-Arnold. That's not bad at all, actually. That's actually pretty decent. We'll take rule breakers Trent. I don't know what he's worth on the market these days. Still about 100, 120k? Probably made a bit of profit with that. That's actually pretty nice. That is a, that's a good card. Take that. Solid. All right. Next, FS uh, Renui Spieler. What are we saying, EA? We haven't had like a huge win yet, in my opinion. First honorable mention. Sadly, it's really, you know, I think it's quite disappointing on EA's part that we can't get actual team of the years, personally. Um... I feel like you should be able to get, like, Team of the Year Hakimi or Team of the Year Ruben Diaz, for example, and they'd just be really, really hard to pack, but that's just me. Um, that being said, there are some nice cards you can get still. All right, we've got my mod Tebow's player pick. Now, Tebow's got some of the best luck, I think, I've ever seen. All right, Tebow's got ridiculous luck. This guy packed two untradeable Messies over Team of the Year. I'm expecting, like, Haaland or something right here. Come on, EA. Eh, it's not bad. It's probably one of the best. Nah, I get it. David's probably not that expensive anymore, is he? David's a good card. I think Kulisevsky's not a bad card either. Um, as a Spurs fan, I thought he'd want Kulisevsky, but apparently he wants Jonathan David. Fair enough. I mean, who am I to judge? All right, next Future Stars reunion player pick. What we say, EA? Can we get something good finally? Can we get a Haaland or a Vinicius, please? Or a numbers up Joao... Felix or in numbers up Eder Militao. Ooh, oh, okay. Ask and you shall receive. I was really excited just because it's one store Jaden Sancho, really. Um, but there you go. Joao Felix. That's a big W. I don't know what Joao Felix is worth actually at the moment. Let me have a quick gander at his price on Footbin. Joao Felix is currently worth 630k. 
Big win. Thank you very much. We'll take that. When you want to talk about good player picks, um, sadly, we didn't record the opening of it. But that is that is not a bad player pick right there. Um, I don't know what Foden's worth. Is Foden worth a ton? Is that a million coins worth of plays in that player pick? Foden. Foden's worth 500k. David's probably about 80, 90k. That's probably 1.2 million coins worth of plays in that player pick. That's a big W. I personally would take Jar Felix just because of the five star skills, but Foden looks insane as well. All right. Next, Future Stars Reunion player pick. Come on, EA. Let's get a big pull. Let's get Eddie Militao or Vinicius. Ooh, wants to watch Upper Meccano. That's a good one, isn't it? What is one Torch Up Meccano worth these days? Dio Up Meccano is worth about 123k. It's all right. I mean, you probably break even. Probably don't break even. Probably like maybe a small loss on that one. But it's a really nice card. And I imagine he'll probably get another upgrade at some point. He does actually get in forms quite frequently. So that's a pretty decent pull in my opinion. Mid or Prime Icon. Net6 and Chill is his club name. I like that. All right. Can we get a decent Prime Icon right here, EA? Come on. Decent prime icon. Here we go. We want all the players to go up and then a big nation. Dutch, Brazilian, French. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Mid JJ Okocha. Oh, no. You knew it was bad when you saw the players not go up at the same time. I mean, hey, Danny Aaron says he's good because his name's been, you know, they named him J twice because he's JJ. So good they named him twice, I think he says. For me, that's a terrible icon. <laughs> All right, next Future Stars Reunion player pick. Come on, EA. Can we get something good right here, please? What are we saying? Day of Meccano and David again. Not, not bad. Up Meccano's decent. I mean, Tierney's probably usable if you want Tierney, but I would probably go Day of Meccano there. Um, it's not bad. It's just not amazing, really. Next Future Stars Reunion player pick. Come on, EA. What are we saying? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. Yikes. You know what would have been really cool? Is if EA remade all of their Future Stars items as a Future Star in this game, but it was only available via this player pick. Now, that is a cool idea. So, Jovic got his FIFA 19 Future Stars item as a Future, future Stars card in this game, but it's only available via this player pick. Now, that would be incredible. All right, we've got my boy Roberts. Uh, future Stars reunion player pick now. He doesn't deserve anything. He got Team of the Year Ronaldo and Tradable, all right? You don't deserve anything in this player pick right here. But he probably will. Probably will. <laughs> Why do you get all the untradable Man United players, man? It's not fair. Why can't I have an untradable Jaden Sancho? I'd be very happy with that. It's a massive W. All right, I've got and built another middle prime icon. You can do two. Um, it's repeatable twice. So I've built a second one now on the pay-to-win account. Uh, the first one was Prime Petter Check. Oh, hey, I would like a, uh, I would like another prime icon. It'd just be nice if we could get, um, if we could get, you know, like a, a decent icon this time and not pet a check. That would be appreciated. Uh, that would be greatly appreciated. All right, here we go. Come on, EA. Give us something decent right here. Give us a nice prime icon. Brazil, Dutch, French would be nice. 